Alright, let's do this one last time. Alright, hey everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Fast Talk, the show where I talk about fast food and talk even faster about it. And today we'll be taking a look at the Mountain Dew's Flamin' Hot. Now if you saw the beginning of the video, which I hope you did, you just didn't jump in the middle of it. Uh, I already tried recording this, but for some reason it didn't record audio. Recorded video, not audio. I don't know how that works, but for some reason it did. When I saw that this was a thing, I was like, I'm not going to try that. Because what this seems like is, uh, you know, the hot sauce that they had a bit ago? Uh, with, I think, Iburn, the company? And then, okay, let's make it into a drink. Because the fools will buy it. So let's, 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 like, legit what they did. So, let's just go ahead and try it. It's... I hesitate to say it's the same... <coughs> excuse me. I hesitate to say it's the same orange as Livewire. Um, but it's very close. It's got... Actually, it's more like a blood orange. So... It has a scent of spice and drills. What am I saying? I've already tried this. So... <coughs> and every time. I did last time too. <coughs> it's got a very strong kick in it. Oh, that didn't feel good. <coughs> trying to hold that, trying to spray it all over my camera. Oh, my goodness. It's very... It tastes like Reservoir Mountain Dew. And then immediately kicks you a little bit. Like Spice and Jarrell. Which I like. And like Spice and Jarrell, I know everyone's not going to like it. Um, it's a very acquired taste. Um, it's not really hot. It's just spice. They easily could have just called it Mountain Dew Spiced. Seeing how there is uh, Mountain Dew Snapped coming out in December for Christmas. Which is interesting. Um, but they probably wanted to get a trademark on Flamin' Hot. As that's something that's been going around. You know, you got Flamin' Hot Cheetos. Uh, they're, like, a bit ago, like, a while ago there was, like, a Mountain Dew. Like, a, like a Doritos Mountain Dew. Like, you could get. It was, like, limited time. It was, like... A weird promotional thing, uh, and then there was also Mountain Dew Doritos. Like Doritos, which I think you could still get, but I tried getting some and they were sold out. So I really don't know. Like it's again one of those weird uh, items. It's a lot like the Celebration Sherbet uh, for the Game Fuel that you can only get off their store for a limited. Like it sold out like in an hour. Like people were really excited to try this. But I think it was just like something weird and new, and then. I think immediately it's going to die down. Um, but it's not bad. Um, will I try it again? Maybe someone gave it to me. But I don't think I would willingly get it again. Because it's... I don't know. It's... Good, but it's my ginger ale. I want to have it time to time. I haven't been able to a more nicer restaurant... I get. Not even that. Like I, I get spicy ginger ale time to time when it's something interesting. Uh, like I like pairing it with certain food items. It's like it's like what that is. Like I would pair it with something interesting. I wouldn't drink it if I'm trying to enjoy a movie. Uh, because I tend to drink things fast during a movie just because of the popcorn. As a, this isn't something you want to drink fast. It, someone made a video where they shotgunned it, and I think you're a maniac. But. Maybe you'll see this video of me insulting you. Um, not really, but I don't know. I don't understand it. I guess I don't know. Um, I don't know. It's good, I guess. Get it if you can. If you have it, good. Uh, if you want to pay the prices off eBay, go ahead. I guess what I did. I think I'm just spending seven dollars to get a can. It's not the dumbest thing. Like I'm not gonna spend two hundred. 
uh, to get Cake Smash. Uh, I already tried it. It's up there. Somewhere. But, I don't know. I'm ending this video, so.